guys, welcome to Boxing Block Center, the home of Nigerian African boxing. And please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe right now. So, guys, um, new news. Olesan Usik has requested an exception from the IBF. Okay. Usik's promoter, Alex Krasso, confirmed that Tim Usik has said to make a request to the IBF that they do not strip him of his world title, meaning the Undisputed Championship will be on the line in Usik's rematch with Tyson Fury. The IBF was expected to strip Usik in the coming days and put a vacant title on the line for the fight between Felipe Ergovic and Daniel Dubois next week. Well, they've made a huge request, you know, and for an exception. I, I think, of course, the Undisputed Everett um, title is a very prestigious um, title to have. Usik. I have to applaud Usyk though. For him to still want to put all those bears on the line so that Fury can have the chance to challenge for it. I think Usyk is a, is a true champion. I just wish this guy could become an household name because if he becomes an household name, if someone, you know, keys can keys around the globe can grow up to learn from not as a boxer because anybody can be a good boxer Floyd Mayweather is still one of the best boxers ever but we know that as a person he is not a nice person we know that and that's fact Bosick on the other hand he is not just a boxer is also a humanitarian you know he reps his country ukraine and yeah he's him right here getting the euros welcome happy to see this guy enjoy you know the fruit of his labor and he's gonna inspire a lot of ukrainian um miss martial hard bo uh, upcoming boxers to do great things as well and it's nice. However, the IBF rule is very strict. You know, Philip Ergovich and Janjali fought for the IBF eliminator at that time, right? So, if you're run by the IBF, by any governing body, there is a certain amount you pay to be run there. So imagine investing. It's like an investment. You invest in something, hoping to get the big, hoping to score a big point. So when you're paying all this money to the governing bodies and at some point you expect to get your hands on the title, right? Chance to challenge for the title. So you cannot blame Egovich because he deserves it. And the IBF don't play. They don't deal with the rules. They are probably the best governing body to keep to their word, basically. They like they are very strict. Um on one hand that is good. On the other hand, it's, you know, it's not good. But in this case, I say, yeah, who thinks you'll be stripped in a way? Because you put on the line after the fight, then they vacate, right? So what sense does it make then? So you mean someone has been paying such any fees for a long time? who have to wait, you know, keep waiting to get us get a chance on the title and Usyk is not young he's getting older he's probably gonna retire very soon so what's the need he's not a young champion defender the undisputed so that's the thing that's the only downside I see in it so guys like the video share subscribe give it those below and let me know what you think should Usyk be stripped uh, because we know that if the IBF title is on the line for Ergovich, uh Dubois, the winner for Joshua. Maybe he could, he could just be, maybe he can be um, another final eliminator. So Ergovich already had that 
um okay so yeah maybe maybe like that and then the win when i fight joshua that yeah, bf that and then one of that go really fight again with the win of Fusi and fury that would make more sense in a way so they earn it like i mean fury has to earn it because if he beats Usyk, then he will want to go for it. And it will, it will have a, it will still have a reason to be in the game. So I tell you right now, Fury is very good. You know, it's crazy. Hmm. Life is crazy, man. Anyways, today is a big day in boxing. Uh, sadly enough, I won't be able to cover it. But Lorenzo Coley fights Rosanski. Um, tonight I will try my best to watch it though I think it's, it's not tonight but I don't know where I can watch it either tonight or tomorrow night I don't know which one but we'll see it's gonna be interesting guys Seriously. 